Hey guys, Lost Wolf here, welcome to Star Wars Uprising. Purge Armor 5 Star completed. Alright, so I'm gonna make this video for you guys just to show off my Purge Armor that I have obtained. I, actually, I have had it for quite a while now. I decided to make a video on it so I can show you guys all the good spec of this really rare armor. Alright, so before we get to the appearance wise, I'm gonna show you guys the stats. So. Let's uh let's uh, let's unequip all of these. All right. So the only way to get the purge armor is to actually participate in the cartel uh, leaderboard uh, like a couple months ago, but Kablam has totally took that out. So I was really fortunate enough for my cartel to rank high in the leaderboard and be able to obtain enough purge armor fragments to even craft purge armor. So, Purge Armor has the highest 7 star PR, so if you get it all to level 7 stars, then you will have the highest PR level of all the other armor that are out there, at 7 stars. If you have an armor that's 8 stars, then that's, that's a lot better than the Purge Armor already, but those are really difficult to obtain. Alright, so, alright, let's go check out the hat. This is the stats for the hat right there, so you'll be able to get uh, 1001 PR. So I won't, I won't read out all the stuff, so I'll let you guys take a look at this. And I also have a Obni Elemental Protection, which provides a moderate amount of protection against all damage types. So that means it gives you a boost of PR and usually anything higher. And uh, usually Purge Armor are usually defensive types, so that's why the armor rating is pretty high. So that's why when you fight those Purge Armor troopers, they are really tanky to destroy all right so here's the purge armor chest you get around 1190 pr so if you guys need a more in-depth look at it you guys can pause the video and here's the purge trooper leg at five star it gives you a thousand nine hundred six uh, ninety six a thousand ninety six and uh here's the back the purge trooper back it gives, doesn't give you too much pr but it still looks pretty cool. All right, and I wasn't able to get a five-star purge armor arm, but I had one before, but I actually upgraded it, so it turns out to be up here. So this is the, so this is the purge trooper lieutenant gloves, and it gives you this much. All right, so let's go equip all these purge armor and see what it looks like. Ooh, slowly equipping all these on. Man, that looks so dope already. Alright, let's go equip the back. Oh yeah, look at that. Purge armor back. And now to get the last one is a Purge Trooper Lieutenant Glove. And I'll just equip the lightsaber just because it looks cool. Alright, where's my lightsaber? There it is. Alright, so I'm going to use the custom appearance. Because if you level up all your armor to max, then you get a... Uh, Cut, you can use it as a custom appearance. So that's what I did. So let's, there you go. So this is what you look like if you level up all your purge armor gear. All right, so I'm gonna be using a different set, but I'll be using, I'll be sure to have this custom appearance. All right, now let's uh, let's go, to, go out and have it as a test ride. Let's see what it looks like in actual combat. So why not? I guess I'll do an assault. Uh, I'll do it on Bespin, why not? Bespin's always fun to do. Alright. Alright, without further ado, let's get started. Alright, I'm a Purge Trooper, Light Saber wielding destruction. Hello, fellow soldiers. Oh, why are you shooting at me? Just because I'm holding a lightsaber? I'll take you guys out. I'm not, well, I'm not really using my lightsaber. I'm just burning them to crisp with my dark poison. Alright, next enemies. Next enemies, I'll use the lightsaber on them. Look at that. It looks, it looks pretty cool. And this is only the five star, so I can't wait what the, the six star looks like. Oh, yeah, look at that. Hua, hua, hua. There you go. Look at that. 
Yeah, so the only way to actually obtain Purge Armor Fragment is to actually do the Lando mission, and those are de really dependently reliant on RNG. So you only have like a really small chance to actually get a Purge Armor Fragment, which will take you forever to even get a fragment to complete a actual whole set. Oh wow, we actually reached the boss already, that's quick. Hello Taskmaster Brisk. Oh, you're gonna do that? Alright, I'm gonna attack you from behind. Ugh. Oh shoot. I hate it when he does that. Alright, time to get serious. Alright, let's go take this guy out. Use my special ability and poison him. Dodge his stun. Hit him from the back. Yeah, Taskmaster Biss is really tanky. And he can stun you, which I, I, I really hate with a, with a, with a passion. Now I'm trying to use my ult. There you go. Yeah, it takes a lot of damage with that uh, Imperil. But too bad it doesn't last too long. But in the end, I'll be able to take him out. Alright, let's go heal up so it makes me feel a lot better before actually finishing the mission. Whoosh! And voila! There you go, guys. Purge Trooper in action. With a lightsaber, <laughs> nonetheless. Oh yeah, look at that epic pose. They never know what hit them. Alright. Okay. Let me uh, show off my guy really quick. I'm gonna slowly pan around so you guys see all 360 degrees of this guy. Yeah, this part of Armor Trooper guy looks really cool and... Maybe it's the second best to my bounty hunter gear, but I'll say that for another time. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this little showcase of the Perch Armor in action. And that's about it. So on that note, I just want to say thanks for watching, guys. And I will see you guys on the next epic Lost Wolf production. I'm Lost Wolf, and I'm signing off.